Hello, we are here for one more lesson of this SCUTCAM training course. The topic for today will be the measuring tools. Um, we have a couple of uh, nice and useful tools uh, in this top menu. One of, one of these, and I think the most important one, it is something called geometry measuring. It's very simple. Uh, as we can choose what we want to measure, so we can come from geometry model to the part, workpiece, job assignment, machining result, if we have some, uh, and we can take measurements uh, on this. For example, part, uh, this is a very simple tool, just click things, and you see we have a radius, we can have some distances, for example, click one point and another point, so it is very easy, uh, it's not uh, a CAD function because uh, it does not enter on the detail that the CAD system has, but easy, uh, we can check a radius, we can check a distance, we can check an angle, so uh, dimensions of uh, a, a, a plan, so very useful uh, and very fast. Uh, it is interesting that uh, we can have uh, machining done also. Let's try to do a, a roughing waterline fast. So, uh, result, so we can have this kind of thing. Took the toolpath out. Going again to measurement, so machining result. And uh, also on this, we can take some measures, okay, click points, see what is happening. And this is the concept of measuring um, this geometry, uh, whatever it, it is. So we can take wall thickness, a lot of things. It is very fast, I think it's a very useful tool. Uh, which uh, you you'll find that uh, in, it, it may help you in a lot of situations without having the CAD because as you know uh, Sprut does not make CAD even that has some simple functions to, to draw a line. So um, I hope this is uh, useful and uh, for sure you take advantage of it. Another interesting um, function you have in this top uh, menu, it is something uh, called the machining report, which allow you to create uh, a, a report uh, sheet with information of uh, the toolpath or group of toolpaths you've created. So you can uh, define what you want in terms of the graphical look um, of the machining and the part. So zoom in, zoom out, whatever you want and the plans uh, split the window in, in several modes, whatever you want, to take some uh, notes, names, dates, whatever you want on this also. Um, and after you set all of this, put dimensions, after you can create and something with this appearance will be done. And this can be uh, set uh, in, in some way, so you can configure this kind of sheet if you want other, other things. But uh, standard, without much work, you have uh, a very nice and clean sheet with the basic information you need to send to production. So uh, both of these functions, I think, are very interesting. Uh, take the best advantage of those and if you need any help in uh, either of these or other topics so let us know uh, through the usual channels uh, so that we can give you all the help and support.